Yo my people, what's good? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Patala FC. We are within. Now, yes, Chelsea have opened the floodgates of transfers. Tosin Adarabayoyo. That's how it's pronounced, yes? Full names are crazy. Full names. Ooh. I know it's Oluwa Tosin, which is of Nigerian descent, I would assume. But let's talk about transfers in general in Chelsea for a second, right? Chelsea are being called the prime hijackers. The premium hijackers. Why? 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 <laughs> because I think almost every transfer, almost, almost, almost every transfer in the Todd Bowley era has seemingly been a hijack or the player would have been linked to a club before us and then we just swoop in and say that player would work for us. Uh, let's name a few, Caicedo, Lavia, uh, Tosin himself was linked to Man United just a week or two ago. Yeah, Mudrik, Arsenal links were everywhere swirling. Um, maybe Jackson. Yeah, no one really gunned for Jackson. Uh, Nkunku was confirmed early. That wasn't even in the Todd Bowley era, I believe. That was still under Roman Abramovich. Uh, yeah, but we could keep going. <laughs> We on the road to 500, yo. Subscribe. First signing of the Enzo Maresca era. A defender. To add on to the surplus number of defenders at Chelsea Football Club at the moment. And I think it sort of confirms that Chaloba will be leaving the club this summer. And we might as well start getting ready emotionally. Uh, because that might also be further confirmation that Gallagher will also be sold. And... Reports keep coming out that Aston Villa have also joined the race for Gallagher alongside Spurs. It's going to be an interesting window for the Chelsea fan emotionally, as well as um, to predict how next season will look. You know, Tosin's arrival makes me think we might play a back three in terms of defense, which could lead us to a strict 3-4-3 system over a 3-5-2, if that makes sense. Because in a 3-4-3 with three solid center backs and i'm thinking on the left but yes shield suffers because levi Cole will, will probably be in the team for his passing ability right side i'm thinking we keep decisive in the team because of their age it's the same age as tosin they're both 26 i think decisive could be 27 however tosin i think starts in the middle of a central three in front of him being caicedo in when we're in defense but in attack i think caicedo also goes forward but tosin solidifies us in terms of a back three, back five in defense. Now, Enzo Maresca, his football might be criticized for the second half of Leicester's season. However, he know, knows as a manager that he can't stick to the exact same strategy that he used for his success in the championship. He's going to have to tweak a few things. And I think if we're going to tweak things, we're going to ensure that we lock defense firstly. I don't think Enzo Maresca wants us to be leaking goals because, I mean, that's the easiest way to lose games, firstly. And it ruins confidence in a young team. We don't have a leader leader still in the squad, besides maybe Gallagher, who's still too young to be called a senior figure in the locker room. So it's going to be an interesting season. But the one thing we don't want to have is conceding two plus goals, game in, game out, and having to fight our way through and drag our way to results almost no it's going to be a season where Enzo Maresca needs to be on his toes honestly he needs to be very woke if that's the right word and I think locking defense the same way Thomas Tuchel locked defense when he arrived at Chelsea and we would score one goal two goals and win big games I believe Enzo Maresca could do that across the season given the number of defenders he has at his disposal and if Chaloba leaves, we still have a lot. If Badia Shio even leaves, we still have enough. Somehow, some way. Wesley Fofana is likely to be fit for the first time in, in I don't know how long. Unless he gets injured in preseason again. But yeah, Chelsea's first signing. More to come, you would of course assume. And we shall see who those will be. We move, y'all.